we have Arunachalam Muruganandam. Let me take this opportunity to invite a founder of Jayashree Industries. He is a social entrepreneur from rural Coimbatore in Tamil Nadu. He designed, created, tested and implemented a sanitary napkin machine that operates on, all, on a small scale. His vision is to make India a 100% napkin using country. Let me take this privilege to welcome Arunachalam Murganandam. Why a man become a menstrual man? This is the topic. So what is necessary why I become a menstrual man? This is what I am going to share in another 20 minutes. So this is a documentary movie made by a western director. Five years before, simply I signed four A4 sheets. He made few million dollars. He is charging every viewer on net $3.99. dollars. I got only the four A4 sheets in my file. <laughs> but now I am a little bit clever. I never signed anyone for a full feature film. Now I am asking for $2 million. Somebody has come forwarding to make us a full feature film. A British company is come, coming forward to make a full feature film. Yeah. And, and then how I started the revolution, so just I changed the name, I am admitting Taikan Kerala, only I am changing that, that line only, Taikan Kerala, Taikan Dubai, Taikan Geneva, all things. But presentation is same, because that is my, my, it is like my name, I can't change my name for every presentation, Muruganandam, Kiruganandam, Dirganandam, <laughs> this is my story. <laughs> then I tell, I don't have any plan to be a revolutionist or nothing. Last 17 years, I did even a small, small thing with a perfect affectionate, with a lot of love, so that every small perfect job became a garland as a revolution, revolutionist, something. That's why to be a revolutionist, no need to be a Napoleon or a Abraham Lincoln, nothing. Every, every human being can be a revolutionist if you do, if you care every action, complete, with the complete perfection, you also become a revolutionist. Then now I am going to take something as beyond marketing. I am run, running a business called JSRE Industries. In my company, I don't have marketing department. I don't have the stupid marketing manager. So <laughs> in spite of how I am doing this work. Then I will, many times uh, people used to call every fortnight to give award. Once, at least twice in a month I will get award. So whenever people are calling me award, I beg them, so on what criteria are giving me the award, what is the award, first tell me the name. They will simply tell, in Tamil, sir, unguluk taram yarak tarade. In English, if you are not deserved, then who else? So this is not the metric, but recently I selected by Time Magazine of New York as the most influential person in the world under people, I am also one. <laughs> you know, the rest now, other four people from India selected, Narendra Modi and Arvind Kejriwal and uh, Arundhati Rai. I am the fourth one. Then is the, I asked the same question with the Times magazines on what grade error gave me. Then they gave 18 points, something complete metrics. Then they told Muruga, you, you are under surveillance for the last 18 months, as usual. <laughs> then they told a simple, Muruga, you convert a social problem into a successful livelihood. That's why you are here with all Bill Clinton, Dick Clinton, Obama, Obama, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So suddenly I'm skipping. 90% of women in India are not using sanitary pads. I can't see women here. A few women are sitting. But this, if I use the slide in Kochi or Bangalore or Mumbai, Delhi, nothing will happen in the hall. While I'm using the same slide in France or in German or in Italy or somewhere, the whole hall will get punctured. Oh my God. Because the women in the hall, they are not able to think if the women are not using sanitary towel and menstruation period, what they are using. But here, nothing is happening in the hall. Women in the hall, they are thinking, okay, if the women are not using towel, maybe she is going to use a rag cloth. But in our experience, we saw even the women not using a rag cloth. Many part of India, the women are using sawdust in their menstruation time and dry tree leaves, newspaper, ashes, even sand. In one part of Northeast India, if the women are getting menstruation, they are going and sitting on a stalk of hay. I told to this news to the Forbes magazine, they come out a special article on it, you check it, women sitting on hay. In spite, they are sending Mangalyan, Budanyan, Sukurvaryan, all yarns in the eye. The women are using sand and dust something. 
then suddenly while i am talking about menstruation something don't think i am a gynecologist or a doctor there is a warning i am a school dropout still now i don't know the vocabulary for sech hr sochochri and never bother about the english for next 20 minutes i am going to kill the english i am going to speak the wrong english <laughs> okay <laughs> so, so why i am telling i am admitting something in the hall i don't know you need guts to tell that i don't know many people you say you know astronomy yes I, a little bit you what subject people are want to become a master of all subject it is impossible many people don't know many things but they will act like everything they know but what i am telling so i don't bother about speak uh, other language into wrong you, i don't i only bother about to speak my mother tongue if you are speaking malayalam into wrong then you feel bad speaking english you are you are granted to speak english in wrong you can shake shoulder yeah da something i don't know why people are shaking their shoulder while speaking english i never saw any englishman speaking shoulder only indians are shaking shoulder <laughs> earlier i thought to speak english first you learn shake the shoulder <laughs> and then i now traveling around the globe never saw any english british no one is shaking the shoulder <laughs> then and this is my presentation because i no need to convince any venture capitalist or venture capitalist in the hall with lot of intersection circle graphs east west something bill and the forecast 2020 40 2000 nothing so indirectly what i am saying so the moment i put the slide how many of the mind says why this man putting a empty slide or a blank slide so nothing in the world is empty i am showing this it is a clear slide if you want to succeed succeed in your entrepreneurship or something business money is not important your wife is not important your mother in law is not important even the government you need clarity that is important that what indirectly i am saying unless service you don't have clarity nothing is going to happen so clarity is happen so luckily i never get educated my mind always like this if i had two phd thesis always confused even to there is two idli and sambar i got a confusion where i can take satni or sambar then i need a helpline madan this is uh, vivek speaking please tell i am having two idlis in front of me but i am having a confusion what i can take so that confusion i don't have so i am a village boy born in coimbatore in orthodox village my father is a handloom weaver suddenly he died in a road accident then my mother became a caretaker of the family then i to support my mother i stopped schooling on uh, ninth standard then i became a workshop helper i, I am a builder i used to make windows that what i told later i show you then later i became a small workshop owner then even seeing many men they are suffering it is very difficult to manage it is very costly affair even after knowing everything i also did the same mistake one day i got married <laughs> <laughs> that too it is arranged marriage the moment arranged marriage so you, you know that many people know the joint family the beautiful thing in, in india without a formal mba from any institute muruvanandam is managing his wife and his mother in the same house for the 14th constituency year many mbas they fail <laughs> okay <laughs> they will call by 6 o'clock evening muruga please come to alangar hotel a executive from the company then i go to the hotel i search in the hall meeting hall then i finally end up in the bar ramesh why are you sitting by 6 o'clock evening in the bar it's a hell man no no recently we bought the apartment for 2 crores no no i am not talking about the apartment the people how many people not under wife and mother <laughs> but is don't think it is very very difficult <laughs> then i try to manage so that's what even i am seeing now that people used to select in an interview there is a, a mandate or rituals five six people will sit with a lot of uh, three piece suit something very serious then other indian people uh, women are boy or girl will come they will knock the door may i come in sir they will say inside the panel very strict come in then finish they will speak off english the candidate will speak off english with off english what they are going to select the correct candidate then one one time i also sit in the in the uh, panel the students na or the candidate they will come with a heavy hefty file their mba certificate is one single page what they are carrying in a big file i saw many people carrying the lemon and spoon certification also while in the school they win na <laughs> why you are carrying from standard one to lemon and spoon all place no no something will happen in the panel then the panel will be very strict with artificial everything then they will ask which is the capital of london then i shall rajesh london is already capital for britain no no i am just checking the alertness of the candidate 
then I said, you are wasting the time, you are selecting a manager or something, don't ask any, all the questions, useless, waste of time. You ask only one thing, are you married? <laughs> if the candidate say yes, are you living with your mother and wife at the same house? Again, he says, how many yes you ask? Anyone say three yes, straight away to appoint any post, you will manage the company. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> It is true. So without managing the two person, how he is going to manage 600 people? That's what is happening in Mara Yudhok. Uh, manager is killed on the floor. You see, now in my city, in Coimbatore, there are two HR managers killed. Because management is not a rigid thing. It is 100% flexible. Now the all I am is become a hatchery. It become, it's hatching a robotic MBA student to manage a business. It will not able to manage. You have to, you need flexible. There is no flexibility. It is under one percent rigidity. How much you pay? 80 lakhs. They are reading newspaper. IAT, last photo getting. So, this is what happened. Then I tried to manage, but being a newly married guy, my important job is to impress my new wife. I used to give a small, small gift, a 5 rupees plastic pendant or a 10 rupees glass bag, not giving it in direct. I used to gift wrap and used to say, close your eyes, Santi, turn left, turn right. This way I am giving a value addiction for the 5 rupees plastic pendant. <laughs> 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 because I am not a Sahar Khan to give every time a diamond pendant. <laughs> like this, girl. so one day I saw Santi is carrying something behind her, the purpose is to hide me. Then I thought she is playing with me, all in noon time, because I can't speak with my new wife in the morning or in the evening. Whenever I try to speak with my new wife, my mother look at me. <laughs> what is happening? Then uh, I ran away behind her on the day, I saw a nasty rag cloth. My wife is adopting an unaging mother to manage her period days. Then I asked her why you are adopting this unaging method, there is sanity devil. She replied instantly, I also know that I am also watching TV, but myself, your sister, the other woman and family start using that. Then we have to cut our family milk budget. Then I getting shot, what is connection between using a sanity devil and not buying um, milk for family? Then I understood it's a matter of affordability. So this all I forget, I have, again I am getting a chance to impress my new wife, why not offer a sanitary packet as a gift? That's my idea. Even now, if you want to buy sanitary towel, the only available place is medical shop or pharmacy store, drug store. Why I am telling three words now? Now I am an international speaker. <laughs> That's why if you tell medical store, they don't know in US. You have to tell drug store, the pharmacy, all. <laughs> then I went to something, a pharmacy or drug store or medical store. Then Sabwala is asking what brand you want, who knows brand and all. I just find out a, a packet, a, new, a beautiful packet instead of showcase. What he did, he took the packet, he wrapped the old newspaper, he, he packed it, he looks left and right, he handed out to me like a smuggling product. <laughs> that makes me ask, what is, why he is doing like this? It makes a curiosity on me, what is inside? Suppose I'm opening the packet, something will jump out from the packet. Because of that, I open the packet, I am taking out the sanitary pad, I am touching a sanitary towel in my life, first time. How many of the men here touch the sanitary pad in your life? <laughs> Simply you can tell, <laughs> really. Very few. That's why in India, Manmohan Singh don't know about sanitary towel. Gulam Nabi Asad don't know about sanitary towel. The penetration of napkin usage is less than 5% real. 95% are not using. This and all I don't know. What I saw, it 8 inch length, maybe a weight is 10 gram. Inside white means a cotton. I am coming from Coimbatore. So in 1994, 10 gram cotton raw material cost is just 10 paise. But I bought that product for 6 rupees, like a venture capitalist, I just calculated the X factor. How many X? Even 10 napkins, they can exit from this <laughs> such a product. So 10 paise, 6 rupees, then I thought, why not try to make a low cost sand repair for my Santi? That makes me to stand here. That's why any, any, anyone to want to do something, <laughs> you start from your family, for your wife you start, definitely you will be succeeded. Don't start with anyone. Start with your wife. Okay. Then I went to a textile mill. I bought a cotton web and I cut it to rectangle. And there is a viscose cloth inside the collar and cuff to make stiff. I wrapped it. So what I bought from the shop, I made a similar napkin in two days. But here the problem is, I am a welder. I am having a small workshop. If I want to do some engineering research, I can very well do it in my workshop. Now I am entering into sanitary towel research. I need a women volunteer. Where I can go? In India, only Swamiji's, Gurujis are surrounded by hundreds of women, whether they ask or not. 
This Murugananda never get a single one volunteer. The only available choice or victim is my wife, Santi. As usual, I gift wrap the two napkins what I made. Close your eyes, Santi. The hand over the napkin, the moment she opens, she gets shocked, oh my God. I selected Friday to hand over this napkin, you know, why you know? I got a gloomy idea about menstruation. In my village, there is a Mariman temple, small uh, temple. There the women will come in front of the temple, only few women will enter, other women will stand. Out of it, I got an idea, women are getting menstruation Friday, Friday. <laughs> That's why I said a good Friday, then I hand over it. But Santi says, you know, no, not like that, you have to wait for some time. That day only I know it is happening monthly once. I am never bothered about telling this in Dias because many men in the India, in India, they become married, father, husband, father, grandfather, great-grandfather, without knowing what is happening, his partner's body, they are dying. I am lucky I came to know at the early stage. Okay. Then I forgot about this. Then I got a result after three weeks. Santi said, what napkin you gave to me? It is very nasty. I am going back to my rack cloth using method. The real research started. Then I tried to use a different, different cotton, mill cotton. I am using, waiting for, giving to Santi and waiting for a month is a time taking process. I need a more women volunteer. Then I catch my wife. The problem is what the topic I am talking, uh, speaking here. A daughter never talked to mother, a wife never talked to husband, friends they don't talk to each other. Earlier I thought this is the taboo or restriction only in India. Now I am traveling everywhere. I asked Catherine in France, Catherine, do you talk about your menstruation with your husband? Instantly Catherine say, why should I should talk about my menstruation with my husband? So this is not only taboo in India, everywhere. Women, they won't talk about their menstruation with anyone around the globe. Take it grant. So, what happened? I am trying to co-create a product. Somebody talking about washing machine. I try to co-create a product. Unless otherwise I am getting a feedback from the customer, I can't create a product in correct. But being a menstruation subject, the women, they always complain is not good. But if I ask why, they become Maniratnam film director. Yes, Deva, no, TK. They will give one word answer. That too, they will turn to the wall, feet, back. So, <laughs> I have to get so that too they will warn one day, if you going on, is going to do this in the house, then we are going to complain with my mother. If my mother knows, then I, it become a biggest problem. Then other problem is, in my house, in all three walls, the gods are hanged on the wall, you know. I told abroad, I used to, we used to hang our god at home. They get shot, why you are hanging your god at home? I said, not hanging, putting nail on the wall, then hanging. <laughs> Whenever I'm trying to talk about menstruation, either Anjana will watch, Sankar will watch, you can't. My wife says, well, in front of Anjana, you're talking this, where I can talk. <laughs> so, then, <laughs> then they warned, then I stopped because of the problem, but I never stopped. Whenever I sit by myself, I, this became a prestige issue. I am working with iron, I am doing everything in iron, but a small cotton matter make me fail. Somebody is making with cotton, with napkin, it is perfectly working with my wife's body. I am her own husband, why my napkin is not working? Then I tried to use the medical college girls. They are also the same problem, they are not giving feedback. Then I got fed up, then I decided one day, why not try sand trip pad myself. <laughs> <laughs> then I wore a sand trip pad, I made an artificial uterus in a football bladder, I filled animal blood in it, I tied here, there is a tube connection from the bladder to the napkin I wore. While I am cycling and walking, I made a small press, a dosage of blood will go there. This way I checked. See, this research completely happened in Pudur, an orthodox village, not in California or Las Vegas. Some village people are watching around me, I never realized. Then one day, Santi, while serving, she is asking, I am going to ask something, don't mistake in me. I said, go ahead. Then Santi says, many of the, my friends are telling you are roaming with medical college girls. <laughs> Somebody, they did their work. <laughs> then I said, no, no, not like that. She never convinced. She said, I want to go to my family for a few days. I dropped her at her family. She never come back. On 20th day, I got a divorce notice. This is the first account I got. Then even after using sanitary pad myself, I am not satisfied. One point of time, I used to collect used pad from the girls. I spread everything on a back out of my home, 10 by 10 room. I am seeing practically what is happening, why it become more trouble, how that softening industry is monopolized by Pepsi and Coke. This is the hygiene industry is monopolized by Procter and Gamble and Johnson and Johnson. No one knows outside what is happening inside, what is the material, what is the nothing. Because I've been taking time from day one to two years, it's going on. My mother is with me, my wife left. 
I am very seriously looking into you snapping from other girls. The fine Sunday, my mother is coming back. I never realized. She thought Sunny is cleaning chicken for Sunday. The moment come and she is absent, nothing she did. She started crying. She said he, he become totally mad. Somebody did on my son. He become totally mad. She also left. The moment my mother left, the whole village, what they told now, some bad spirit entered in my body. I become a vampire at night. I am drinking girl's blood. They want to tie my both the leg with the iron chain and holy tree upside down. Or they want to chase out. So they are trying to kill me before they are going to chain me or the tree they will kill me. Then I ran out, ran out from my home in the midnight like a thief to the nearby city. I stayed there. I found out the raw material, what is it. Even after finding another struggle, you need a multi-million dollar machine like this to process the particular material. I am asking the educated people here, if you are trying to do something, it become harder, more harder than it become mountain, what you will do? So my philosophy is, if you are trying to do something, it become harder, it is more harder, it is a clear indication by God, go ahead, if you do it, it is worth. The same if you are trying to do it, become easier, you drop it, even if you are doing it, it is useless. To make understand, I, I used to uh, tell like this in colleges, if you are chasing a girl in your, com in your campus, you are chasing the girl for six months, you are not able to get her mobile number, the girl is worth, you chase for another three months. The same you are chasing a girl, in 10th minute the girl is standing you, you want my mobile number, don't chase her, it's dangerous. <laughs> so like that. <laughs> so, then I worked another four and a half years on this method. This is the only method given by God, anyone trying to do something new or innovate, it is trial and error method. So because I used my money, my blood, Sometimes I used to donate my blood for traveling expense. I am boldly saying here in public, I used to trial and error method to invent a new thing. But the same thing, if you are trying to do with other people money or public tax money or something, they won't tell like this openly. That's why they coined the word called like this. <laughs> what they are doing? Research and development, nothing but trial and error. They, this happened. What is happening in large scale collagen? Nothing has happened so far. You go and read. Earlier they have 24 kilometer tunnel, they are looking for 60 kilometer tunnel. That means so far what they did? Trial and error with 10 countries money. So I don't have nothing. So what I am telling, if you are anyone here, a new entrepreneur something, don't bother about, go on this trial and error method. Business is, you can learn only by this method only. Any university in the world can't teach the business. To learn business, only method given by God is trial and error. Can you agree? Yeah, okay. That's what happened. So out of it, I designed the machine after seven and a half years from the day one. So this is the equipment. Any uneducated woman can apply the raw material what they're using in Johnson plant. They can create, they can make a world-class napkin. Then I sent the machine to IIT of Chennai for evaluation. There are man uh, uh, professors or engineers with French beard and Bermuda and Nike shoes. Those days, if I see a man, I'm a little bit scared, I'm a little bit getting away because that they're all intellectual genius, I thought, those days. Because I don't know such English particular day. Then they are seeing the machine, there's something they are criticizing, but I'm able to understand, but I'm not able to answer back. That's what I'm strongly saying in the public dais. No way linguistic is connected with skills, working skills. Many people, they can talk, they can't do it. Many people, they do, they can't talk. Because those days, what they are criticizing, why this man spending a lot of money, risking his life to make this simple equipment, what is going to do with this? Because they are comparing Johnson and Procter and Gamble, they are criticizing what the, this man is going to do with this machine. My answer for that engineers on the day, I am the son of a handloom weaver, myself and my father, we bought a handloom weaving machine, 90% made of wood, for 3,000 rupees 30 years back. We installed at our home, my father made a handloom series with cotton, we sold, we survived, three children, my father, mother. We never die amid of 400 fully mechanized mill in my city. That means my, my, my father don't want to use that 3,000 rupee equipment to rub shoulder with mill owner. The same way I am seeing my machine having a capability of giving livelihood for women. I want to prove it. That's why I took the machine on donkey's back, somewhere in the remote part of Bigar. Video.
पूजा फॉर न्यू सैनिटरी पैड फैक्ट्री मधुबनी नियर नेपाल बॉर्डर So earlier you need 200 crore to set up a sanitary napkin factory. Now any woman can set up this factory. Then it becomes succeed. Then I slowly I do it for four years. No one know outside. I made a machine at Coimbatore. Then I took to North India, Bihar, Orissa, Chhattisgarh. They are my stakeholder. I no need to say this woman are poor. The porter is enough. They are all called extremist. Naxal's wife, Mao's wife. I used to work with Naxal wife, Mao's wife. They are telling who knows. I work. Then they claim Muruga don't go inside the jungle. Everyone knows the story appeared in Deccan Chronicle. Everything. I took the mission on donkey's back. This is in Uttarakhand. It is 18 hour drive from Dehradun. Then only government lay the road. See, the villages are situated on the slope of hill. I don't know how many villages come into Indian census. The back view. Even if you are having cancer, stay there for two and a half months and walk on the tribal path. You will have six packs here. The cancer will cure. Such a area. Now it becomes familiar. So that's what I showed to a CEO of a big company, transnational company. Sir, this is called rural marketing. This is called to go this place. Johnson will take another 25 years. Muruga is already there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you see, the school girls are making with a small machine at schools. They will pay only raw material. They are making more napkins. Many girls are selling nearby villages. They are making money. And while you are learn, this is the project we are doing. The girls. Then he ended up with President Award. You are getting more and more award. I lose my privacy. Now I am talking only in public desk. <laughs> Not like that. I am doing. I am. So what I did? Something business means something you want to market. The conventional thing everyone know it is called retailing. Whether you are doing machine, uh, this car, everything retailing. Then suddenly all bun sells, gin sells. Everyone become very nice on this <laughs> retailing. One billion, five billion, ten billion. Oh my God! Both these stupid things can't do any single percentage social change in society. You can't. But what we are doing, Muruga's model is we are detailing. You brave to detail. We are detailing. That's why we are competing Johnson and Procter and Gamble. I never bothered Obama. I never bothered about no one. No one can do it because you have to spend time. You need a lot of volunteers. It's not drawing a check for billion. So out of detailing. Another video, please. We created around 867 brands. You can play that. So these are the local brands done by the small machine, decentralized. There are 877 brands come out in this business model. Go. They are surviving against. While I am presenting in Spain, 846. <laughs> Now it is 877. Switch over. Finish. So that's why a nine standard speaking with Paul Polman, the CEO of Unilever. That okay. And the black coat is Sanjeev Mehta of executive director of Hindustan Unilever. Why I am in the middle? I am giving a lecture for Polman and 70 CEOs in a closed room talking about rural marketing. <laughs> He <laughs> said, "Up with." I spoke. Now I am a corporate speaker for all livers, gears. Somebody just I got a call from international paper, this paper. So I am naturally speaking. So this was because rural marketing is a fancy word. You can achieve by your revenue can go this way, but your profit will go down because it's very expensive. But how we are doing? That's why it became a fashion at across the globe. I can teach you. Anyone want to do it? It's a recent picture. <laughs> Just two weeks back in Seattle, they are laughing like anything. I think first time Belgians is laughing. All this work, everything. Ah, that's it. I said actually I spoke against this man. I told in in the world people are accumulating millions, billion. Then suddenly they are talking about Pilan Darvi. Muruga is doing philanthropy. Why? What is the need of accumulating billion? I started philanthropy from the day one. It's there in YouTube. I'm <laughs> sitting. Then again, I am talking there. I no way connected with Windows. Actually, I am also making Windows, but in iron. I don't. I am also making Windows in iron. <laughs> 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 
sir, I thought so. But no one believe. While I'm coming back from Seattle, even my family, all the corporate were looking at my eyes. What the size of the briefcase I'm getting from Bill Gates? I said nothing. I get. I said nothing. I want from Bill Gates only friendship. I said. So this one. So this become a news. I'll skip. I'll read all. So what is that uh, need to build a new organization? A problem, not the luck or nothing. So look for a problem. Don't look for an opportunity. It's outdated model, 1932 model. Anyone looking for an opportunity, you are trapped into danger, like Monica Lewinsky. Okay, don't trap into Monica Lewinsky. So look for a problem. Okay. <laughs> so then, then I try to consult my company on a measurable social impact, not on revenue base. It is clearly on measurable. So only my auditors, my accountant know about turnover or something. I only keen on measurable social impact. So far, thousand eight hundred machines set up in twenty four different states of India. And this is the word I am getting by world. You are king of frugal designing, successful disruptive designing, rural marketing. So somebody told a blue ocean strategy. In the ocean, there is a big well, small fish. Don't fight each other. Oh my God! I am doing it for last 14 years, man. You know, West always very clever. They simply they write book only. They don't do. <laughs> I shared a dais with one author. Sir, what business you are doing? I am an author. No, no, I am asking what business you are doing. I am an author. That means you are not do, you are not doing anything practical. I said, he is no like that. They will see six step, four step like this. What step? Nothing step to succeed in business. You have to die. No book can teach you. <laughs> so, okay. Then frugal way of overcoming competition. Finally, they called me corporate bomber. I never put any bomb on any corporate. This is what. This is a time function at New York Lincoln Center, Times Square. I thought at least. Arvind Kejriwal or Arun Dajra will come. I can stand behind them because my English has become a problem. Nobody will come there. Then finally, I am there. You see, I am walking on a red carpet like eyes for your eye. Every time I have to laugh. Under camera, still taking photographs. <laughs> you see, the white background. Then they are bombarding question with mics, stick mics. So we feel Modi is Indian Putin. What is your opinion? If I say something, if I come down to Delhi, they will kill me. <laughs> okay. Then they are asking somebody to stand on Sri Lanka is not good. I can't say go and ask Manmohan. Then finally a girl is chasing the crowd. One minute, one minute, please, Muruga, why modeling is not picking up in India? Modeling, why modeling is not picking? I said Santi is not interested. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I managed the crowd. See the white background. I managed. I going to the first floor. Again there is a crowd. They told Muruga this is allied press. Is ordinary person that ground floor the first floor airline press all BBC CNN see I can't ask repeat once more once more one time with this thing finally a school dropout handle India because if you cross Indian Ocean you are not Murugan Andam or Swabana or nothing you are India I represent India with my little English but I did it I got okay so. This what happened. The measurable social impact created so far. 18,000 women got direct employment. Almost 8 million women shifted from unemployment method. The vision is creating a million rural employment for poor women and making India into 100% standard deviation country from the current level of 5%. This is a cumulative achievement of Independence India from 1947 to 2014 with 13 president. I don't know how many prime ministers and 578 MPs and millions of siren footed vehicle. Wia, wia, wia. So whenever I stop the road, the fleet of siren footed vehicle going, I laugh. Where you are going to make India into five percent country? Then whenever I read next week, India going to send women to moon, I laugh. First you give sand repair to the women, then you send the women to moon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, so not only India, the desire is very well matched for 106 developing nations. So far we spread 17 countries. So that's why this is called silent pink revolution. This is the country we are having already having presence. So now we are having around 140 million dollars revenue. Some agency they measured our value is 1.6 billion dollars. That's why a lot of eagle are circling around me. <laughs> okay. So this is called beyond marketing. Thank you very much. Bye. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. All of us had a great time laughing, listening to your motivational motivational words, and we all had fun. <laughs> Isn't it? All of us, all of us are completely cheered up now. And now I request our Thai member, Mr. Roy, to kindly come forward to present the memento. That's why I'm going back. Suspense. Thank you.
we reunited, don't worry. We reunited after seven and a half years. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, right. <laughs> In the, come back home. Yeah. We reunited because uh, suddenly I am on the limelight after getting awards. So I am in all <laughs> newspaper. I am sitting in live TV, Vanakam Tamilagam R. Then those days I am carrying one kilogram Ericsson phone, like a brick, you know. We are paying incoming for 30 rupees, 13 rupees. On that I got a call, do you remember the voice? And I said, how can I forget you? But don't believe anyone because I, what I trick I did now while we were separation, I never allowed anybody in between, my wife and me. Many people, they want to come in, they want to do. I said, thank you. We are meeting every Friday at Temple. The moment they, what do you call in English the word? To not compromise. Mediate. The mediator, those who are coming forward to interest, I said, no, we are meeting each other now. The mediator face will go sad. See, if you allow mediator, they will make this separation into permanent. <laughs> but you educated people, any misunderstanding happen, you sit in front of lawyer, then they will finish everything. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you for joining us once again.